Imagine a tiny machine, no bigger than a car, built by human hands, crafted with care, precision, and a sense of wonder about the universe. This remarkable creation was sent on a journey beyond our wildest dreams, leaving the only home it ever knew behind. This is Voyager 1, our silent ambassador to the stars, carrying the hopes and questions of an entire planet. Launched in 1977, it carries the sights and sounds of Earth, a message in a cosmic bottle, meant for any who might find it in the distant future. Its mission at first was to explore Jupiter and Saturn revealing their mysteries and beauty to us for the very first time. Then, as its work continued, it ventured beyond the edge of our solar system, into the unknown. Voyager, one has traveled farther than any object we've ever made, crossing distances we once thought impossible. It has sent back breathtaking images and invaluable data that transformed our understanding of the cosmos and our place within it. It's more than a probe, it's an extension of our senses, our curiosity, and our hope for connection with the universe. For over 40 years, it sent us postcards from the edge of our cosmic neighborhood, each one a reminder of how far we can reach. Now, more than 15 billion miles from home, its power fading, Voyager 1 still whispers data across the void, defying the silence of space. It is the first human-made object to enter interstellar space, a profound achievement that marks a new chapter in our exploration. Through Voyager 1, we've touched the space between the stars, reaching out farther than ever before. We've sent a piece of ourselves into the galaxy, a symbol of our desire to know what lies beyond. Its journey is a testament to human ingenuity, teamwork, and our relentless desire to explore the unknown. Voyager 1 connects us all to the cosmos in a real and inspiring way, reminding us of our shared journey. It reminds us, we are part of something much bigger, and our story is just beginning to unfold among the stars. Voyager 1's story began with a rare planetary alignment, a chance for a grand tour of the outer solar system. Launched in 1977, it was packed with cameras, spectrometers, and magnetometers, ready to explore Jupiter and Saturn. At Jupiter, Voyager 1 revealed the Great Red Spot as a swirling storm, discovered faint rings, and witnessed volcanic eruptions on Io, the first seen beyond Earth. At Saturn it unveiled the complexity of the rings and studied Titan's thick orange atmosphere. The flyby of Titan sent Voyager 1 on a new trajectory, out of the plane of the planets toward the stars. The grand tour was over, but a greater mission had begun. Voyager 1 was now on a path to interstellar space. Its discoveries at Jupiter and Saturn revolutionized our understanding of these worlds, but its ultimate journey, beyond the solar system, was just beginning. A new era of exploration had dawned. After Voyager 1's planetary tour, it headed for the edge of the solar system. Scientists believed the solar system was enclosed in a magnetic bubble, the heliosphere, formed by the solar wind. The boundary, called the heliopause, was expected to be a calm, clear transition into interstellar space. Models predicted a drop in solar particles, a rise in cosmic rays, and a smooth shift in magnetic fields. The scientific community waited, watching for these signs as Voyager 1 approached the unknown. Decades passed as the probe neared this invisible frontier, but the universe rarely matches our tidy models. Voyager 1 was about to reveal a far wilder reality. As Voyager 1 moved farther from the Sun, its data defied expectations. Instead of a smooth transition, the boundary was turbulent and chaotic. For years the spacecraft seemed to cross multiple false frontiers, solar particles dropped, cosmic rays surged, then reversed. In August 2012 everything changed, solar wind particles vanished and cosmic rays spiked. Voyager 1 had finally crossed into interstellar space, yet the magnetic field direction didn't change as predicted, puzzling scientists. The mystery was solved in 2013 when plasma wave data revealed a much denser environment, evidence of the interstellar medium. Voyager 1 was truly beyond the sun's influence. The crossing was not neat or simple, but a monumental leap for science. We had entered the space between the stars, the universe was more complex than we ever imagined. Our theories painted a simple picture of the solar system's edge, a smooth boundary, a clear magnetic shift, a predictable environment. Voyager 1 shattered those expectations. The boundary was a chaotic frontier, not a neat line. The magnetic field didn't change direction. It stayed aligned with the suns, hinting at a deeper connection to the galaxy. The interstellar plasma was denser and more turbulent than models predicted. Instead of a calm ocean, Voyager found a dynamic, ever-changing environment. 
These surprises mean our solar system is not isolated, it's interacting with the galaxy in dramatic ways. Voyager 1 confirmed some theories, but more importantly, revealed where we were wrong. In science, that's where discovery begins. New mysteries await, and our place in the cosmos must be reimagined. Voyager 1's journey is a reminder. The universe is always more surprising than we expect, and that's what makes exploration so thrilling. To truly grasp Voyager 1's journey, we first need to understand the staggering scale of our cosmic neighborhood. The Moon, our closest neighbor, is 239,000 miles away, a distance that once seemed insurmountable, but Voyager 1 is now over 15 billion miles from Earth, far beyond the reach of any human spacecraft before it. A radio signal traveling at the speed of light takes 22 hours to reach Voyager 1, just one way. That means a simple hello from Earth takes nearly a full day to arrive. Our solar system is unimaginably vast, with planets orbiting a star so large it could fit a million Earths inside. The distances between planets are measured in millions or even billions of miles. Even Neptune, the most distant planet in our solar system, is only a fraction of the way to the Sun's edge of influence, a boundary called the heliopause. Voyager 1 hurtles through space at 38,000 miles per hour, a speed that would circle Earth in just over an hour. Yet, it still took 35 years to break free from the Sun's protective bubble and enter interstellar space. Now, it drifts through the Milky Way, a galaxy containing hundreds of billions of stars, each with its own potential planets and mysteries. The nearest star beyond our Sun, Proxima Centauri, is 4.2 light-years away, so distant that even light, the fastest thing in the universe, takes over four years to get there. At its current speed Voyager 1 would need an astonishing 75,000 years to reach Proxima Centauri, a journey far longer than all of recorded human history. It's not even aimed at any particular star, instead it will pass near Gliese 445, a faint red dwarf, in about 40,000 years, a blink in cosmic time, but an eternity for us. By then Voyager 1 will be a silent relic, its power long gone, drifting endlessly through the void as a testament to human curiosity. Voyager 1 is now a ghost ship, carrying our story, our music, and our message into the endless night between the stars. Its voyage reminds us just how small we are, and how vast and mysterious the universe truly is. Voyager 1 carries a unique cargo, the Golden Record, a shimmering artifact bolted to its side as it drifts through the endless dark. This gold-plated disc is more than just a time capsule, it's a greeting to the cosmos, a message from Earth to anyone, or anything, that might one day discover it. Chosen by a team led by Carl Sagan, the contents were carefully selected to represent the diversity of life and culture on our planet. It holds 115 images, greetings in 55 languages, and sounds from Earth. Wind, rain, animals, music, laughter, and more capturing the essence of our world in a single record. It's a visual and audio snapshot of life on our planet, meant for any intelligence that might find it. The record includes instructions, diagrams of our solar system, mathematical symbols and scientific information, as well as our location in the galaxy, mapped out for any future finder to decipher. It's built to last a billion years, long after Earth is gone, silently traveling farther than any human-made object before it, the odds of it being found are almost unimaginably small, but the act of sending it is profound, a gesture of hope and connection. The golden record is our message in a cosmic bottle, a declaration that we were here, reaching out across the stars. It's a testament to our curiosity, our creativity, and our enduring hope for connection beyond our world. Even if no one ever finds it, you know the golden record marks our place in the universe, a silent witness to our existence. Voyager 1 carries our story into eternity, a symbol of humanity's desire to be known, remembered, and understood. Why does Voyager 1 matter? For science, it's an unparalleled triumph, rewriting our understanding of the outer planets and interstellar space. It challenges our theories and inspires new questions. Every faint signal is a glimpse into the unknown. Voyager 1 is our lone witness at the frontier, but its importance goes beyond science. It's a symbol of human curiosity and unity, a reminder of what we can achieve together. Its legacy is perspective, the pale blue dot image showing Earth as a fragile speck in the vastness. Voyager 1 is our legacy, a piece of us drifting through the galaxy. It will outlast our cities, our nations, perhaps even our species. It carries our science, art, and hope into the future. 
Voyager 1's journey is about what it means to be human, and that story will never cease to matter.